So it's another beautiful brand new day, brand new night, depending on wherever you are watching me from. My name is Jim Ralph. Kindly subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and always stay connected for time, bro. Um, Ashake, Ashake, Nigerian Afrobeat superstar Ashake, Nigerian Afrobeat and piano superstar Ashake as well made an interesting statement that has been trending since yesterday, and it's really worth talking about, yeah. And like before we go watch the video, I need to tell you that I totally agree with Ashake with that statement. You know, it was actually a longer conversation, but we are going to, you know, base our editorial on, you know, that sector, that initial, you know, statement that he made. Yeah. Because like, I really, I totally agree with Ashake. 100%. I totally, 100% is even underrated, bro. 1000%. Yeah, I agree with Ashake thousand percent. But before we speak about it, let's go check out exactly what Ashake said and come back. Fun time, bro. Kindly subscribe to his channel. Like, comment, and always stay connected. Fun time. People took me for granted because of my humility. Ashake, famous singer Ahmed Ololade, aka Ashake, has recorded how some people once took him for granted because he was too humble. In a video making the rounds on social media, Ashake while chatting with a group of friends stated that it is better to be egoistic than to be too humble as he emphasized that excessive humility often brings disrespect. As he emphasized that excessive humility often brings disrespect. Speaking from experience, Ashake said that when someone is egoistic, people feel the person is inaccessible and place more value on the person. He said, to me, humility is like a waste of time. People don't appreciate it. At the end of the day, life is about your perception. That is how I think. It's my world. I've been around people that I try to let them see who I am, but they didn't appreciate it. As an artist, if you come to somewhere, if you are humble, they will take you for granted. But if you have ego, they feel like you are not accessible, so they will like you more. People will rather see what you're doing than you showing them humility. So just do what you need to do. You know, I've, I've, I've been around people that I try to like let them see how I do it, but they didn't appreciate it. They rather see. Uh, it's just like let me put it like this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. An artist, yeah. if you come to somebody, if you come like, if you are humble, they take you for granted. Mm. But if you have ego, they feel like you are not accessible, yeah. then they like you more. It's still like that. So people would rather see what you are doing than show them, oh, I'm, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. They don't really appreciate it. Do what you need to do. I'll even ask you for opinion. Oh, is it? Yeah, that's the kind of person I am. Yeah, so all Ashake is trying to tell, you know, all the superstars around the world, all the musicians around the world, is to place value on yourself. Look, in life, there's nothing wrong with you trying to be too humble. But at the end of the day, the truth is people don't appreciate humble people. At the end of the day, people do not appreciate musicians who are too humble. Do you know that in life, like uh, in our industry, even when you come to Ghana music industry, the people that we normally see to be too humble are the ones who allow themselves to be fooled. The ones who allow themselves to be taken advantage of are the ones that we normally perceive to be humble. But if someone is trying to be too difficult, when someone is trying to be, you know, play like someone is trying to be hard someone is not like allowing himself to be taken advantage of he is seen to be arrogant yeah he is seen to be arrogant and that's what ashake is saying look a musician as a musician you just don't you just don't have to you know go into a crowd and like just feel like hey i'm here i'm here and like and begin to you know be humble to people like that they will not like they will not value you that is the truth they will not value you that's one thing i've been actually thinking about heaven like just one day we all die and we go to heaven i heard i heard from what the pastors and uh imams and all these people have been preaching that we will be walking on gold just imagine we're going to heaven to walk on gold do you think gold will have value again because like at the end of the day everybody has gold so, you know, no one will place high value on gold again. Look at how valuable gold is. Look at how how valuable diamond is. Just like, just imagine we all wake up in this world and, you know, all the soils we've been working on has turned into diamonds and golds. 
no one will place value on it again because Charlie, okay, and that's one reason why uh when you learn economics, money is supposed to be scarce. Money is not supposed uh money is not supposed to be too accessible. You have to, you know, fight for it so that you place value on it. That's the same like same applies to you know stardom and you know the music industry. You always have to place value on yourself. Else people will take a look in we are living in the world where people are kind of we have a lot of people who are not intelligent enough to know that okay this person is being humble or respect is reciprocal so this person is being humble all in the name of okay at the end of the day we are all human beings we are all human beings so he's supposed to be humble yeah but they will rather see it from a weak like they will rather see you to be very weak yeah when you are too humble the world see you to be very weak me for instance i'm very humble like i'm very very humble but there are times i try to be difficult i try to be difficult look i and you know when it comes to superstars being you know egoistic around i like i really i really understand them there are a lot of uh times that i saw superstars like celebrities out out there and i felt like okay no i i feel like okay let me just look at him but i shouldn't go take a picture yeah i shouldn't go because he's not in there it's right uh He's not his, uh, in his right state uh, to take photos. And at the end of the day, if you approach him and he bounces you, you like if you like it's uh you are not someone who is in your right, like you can really reason well. You will feel like the person is being uh, egoistic or the person is being disrespectful to you. Meanwhile, like we all have our characters, and I understand them. I understand them. Look. When I meet a superstar and I feel like going to take a picture, when I've after taking the picture, no matter how I love your songs, no matter how I love your movies, or no matter how I love your crafts, you are not my friend. You are not my friend. I need to, you know, I need to understand that. I need to create that distance. You know, whenever you meet a superstar out there, just go take your picture, you know, appreciate his craft, but you don't have the right to, you know, be chatting with him like a friend. Yeah, you don't have the right to be chatting with him like a friend. They will not give you that chance. And you know, all the musicians who normally... And that's true, like that's true. All the musicians who have been too humble. Look, I know a, I know a lot of musicians who are very humble. I know a whole lot of musicians in Ghana who are very humble, but the industry do not appreciate them. And, the, and at this point, I can mention one person like Shatawali. The industry sees Shatawale to be very disrespectful because he would never allow himself to be cheated. He would never allow himself to be cheated. Yeah, I understand the fact that sometimes he goes overboard, you know, he tries like Shatawale can be, you know, but that's who he is. So if you think you can't uh, tolerate his behavior, then you should do things right. You should do things right or you should distance yourself from him. Because at the end of the day, we all have our egos. Charlie, we all have our egos. No, like he has his ego. And like at the, mo the moment Shatawale will begin to be humble, Charlie, the whole the industry will try to you know take advantage of you. The industry will try to take advantage of him. In this world, like I told you before. People are not intelligent enough. People are not wise enough to know that, okay, yeah, we are all humans, so we should be uh, humble to ourselves. We should be humble to ourselves. <clears throat> People place value on things they can't get access to. That's the truth. Like, in this world, we all place value on things we don't have. Just imagine Bill Gates. Bill Gates is still searching for something that he doesn't have. Dan Gute is still searching for something he doesn't have. So at the end of the day, I agree with Ashake. Like I really, really agree with Ashake. I really agree with what Ashake said. Yeah, I agree with Ashake. Charlie, you shouldn't humble yourself too much. You should not humble yourself too much. People value things they don't have access to. That's the truth. People value things they don't have access to. Just imagine today, like I told you, we all wake up and we have gold. Every about 
8 million people in on this planet all of us we have you know let's say uh, let me just say uh, about 10 bars of gold each all the 8 billion people around the world we have 10 bars of gold each no one will value gold anymore because at the end of the day it has it has become too accessible yeah so celebrity stardom is like gold you should make yourself too uh you should make yourself very, very inaccessible because no one like if you become too like chale humility everybody like whenever everybody calls you you are there and all those kinds of no one will even pay to come watch your show because they're like you have nothing else to offer because you are on the street why should i come pay for uh a music show? why should i come pay for it <laughs> why should i come pay for a show that uh is headlined by a musician that i always see on the street freely huh why kindly subscribe to this channel like comment and always stay connected fun time bro yeah <laughs>